You know, these videos are fast becoming... Did you hear my voice then? <laughs> you know, these videos are fast becoming my favourite ones to record. For so long, I've been saying that my channel is all about budgeting and everything like that. And honestly, I am not the star of this show. The budget is the star of this show. But what my budget is able to do for me is quite some spectacular things. So in today's video, we're going to be cash stuffing £150. Now, I don't normally get to do this. It's just because January's budget and how much I got paid was so significantly high for me that I wanted to experience cash stuffing every single week, really, really enjoy myself and do a lot. Trust me, I've saved a lot of money into lots of different pots and Today we're just playing around with £150 and we're getting closer towards my bucket list goals and the secondary things and the things that I want to be working on in the background. So Bestie, let's get into today's video. Okay Bestie, here we are back at again. We've got the purple drop down, we've got the purple cash tray and today we're stuffing £150. Let's count out what we got. So we've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 1 and then 10, 20, 30 and then 35, 40, 45, 50, 150 pounds, nice. Big Bertha always comes first. So we're gonna do her, and if you're not familiar with her, she's my four and a half K uh, mega dice challenge, and she comes with seven dice. We've added an eighth dice to this, and they look a little bit like this. So what we're doing is rolling all eight dice every single week, uh, well, every week that I can, and whatever it tells me, I'm gonna save. So we were brutalized two weeks ago, and hopefully it's gonna be a bit kinder this week. So let's roll. Okay, double zero. Double zero. That's a week off. That's a week off. <gasps> That's so good. Should I re-roll? Should I risk a re-roll? Okay, done all the 80s. Should I risk another re-roll? 60. Yeah, let's do 60. Let's do it. Okay, so we do need to save some pound coins out of here. So I think I've got 10 in here. So let's do that this time. So uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we've still got a pound here. So if I rescue her because she's trapped, um, that's all good. Let me put this 10 in here and then we are good to go. So starting off with this one, we did a four. And I think I'm gonna put the four, no, I'm not. I'm gonna put in a five and take a one out. That's what I'm gonna do. So let's put in a five. Stop, I hate this, how the coins don't stay at the front. All right, take out a one. And then we've got a four to sign off. Only two more, and then this one's like done with the fours. Next is a two. Um, I'm gonna put two in, see how it goes. Put in two, one, two, and then sign off a two here. And then next is a one. It's gonna have to be just chucking a one in, isn't it? So let's do that and sign off this one. Running out of ones here. Eight, five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Wow. Or maybe I should take out, maybe. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put in a 10 and take out two. That's what I'm gonna do. So put in a 10, take out that lovely two pound coin and then sign off this eight. Eight, here it is. Where is it? Here. <laughs> Next is a one, so I'm just going to add a one in here. There's not much more I can do than that. So let's sign off this one. Still haven't done a three yet for this one. And then for the 500, I'm going to put in nine. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Lovely. So this has distributed the coins a little bit better this week has. So that's good. So let's sign off a nine. And then it's nine again for the 1K. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Beautiful, beautiful, stunning. So let's do a nine here. Cool. And then it's gonna be 60 for this one. So two, four, six, 
So it looks like we're left over with a fair bit of money. So let's just put this in and sign off this 60 here. I mean, we could have got away with it, but you know what we're like. So we've got 20, 40, 50, 55, 56. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put 21 into the save 6K challenge because that's one full line of one to six. Um, it makes me happy to, I'm just gonna put it at the back. It makes me, I'm just gonna do that. So that's 21, that's done. I'm gonna sign it off the post up right now. So we're done with her and these. So let's take a quick look at here. So we've got 35. Um, what do I want to do in here? It'd be nice to put another 10 into, uh, another 20, sorry, into car insurance. So let's grab all of this out. Let's put 20 in and get a yellow pen, which I know you're going to moan at because you can't see, but um, I'm colouring that in now. Okay, she's done and we're left with 15 pounds. So what should we do with that? Um, I'm gonna put a tenner into month ahead because why not? Um, should we put it into clothing? Should we? Oh, I could have done Simon and Gracie. Oh no, maybe I'll do that next week. Right, I'm gonna try and do it next week. I'm gonna put a fiver into clothing because why not? Um, and then next week, I'm gonna to try to scratch off a scratcher with you. So this is uh, the Onyx challenge. So if I've got like 50 quid left over, I'll try to do it. So cool, All right, that's me done for the week. Thank you so much for being here with me this week. Hi guys, guys, and on Bypass, thank you so much for getting through to the end of the video. You know I love it when you get through to the end of the video. Please give this video some love. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you are going to comment, use this emoji. Do you cash stuff weekly? Um, I know most people just cash stuff at the start of the month, depending on how much you get paid. Uh, I know people who get paid every two weeks who cash stuff every two weeks. I know people who get paid weekly and cash stuff every week, but it's not very common for somebody who gets paid monthly to sort of eke it out over every single week and I do that for myself because it just brings me so much joy. I think if I j only cash stuffed at the start of the month it would become difficult and tough for me and a bit boring so being able to do it weekly and to hold some money back is quite a pleasure and I'm aware of how blessed and lucky and privileged I am to do that so thank you for putting me in a position where that is possible this month at least. Thank you so much for getting here but an extra special thank you to the channel members and the patrons who make all of this possible i truly mean it when i say without you i would not be here patrons get exclusive content sneak peeks and significant discounts off my etsy store channel members get early access to every single video i publish so if you'd like to join them on either patreon or on youtube have a look at the link in the description you will not regret it bestie that's all we have for this week and next week we have one more I don't know if we're going to have any in February, but we've got one more for January. So until then, I would like you to have a wonderful day, have a wonderful week and have a wonderful budget. Always remember, don't trust Ira. And Bessie, I'll see you next week. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.